customer comes comes in we create sales order sales order once sales order is getting created on the back of it purchase requisition will be created based on purchase requisition order confirmation purchase order will be created and no more goods issue or goods uh, goods received or goods issue no more goods issue because vendor from his from his plant he sends a stock to the customer directly to the customer vendor sends the stock to the customer directly from vendor's plant to customer so no more goods issues or goods received will not be uh, will not come into the sap or will uh, goods received will not come to the plant directly it goes to the customer the only thing is we exchange Oops. the bill with the vendor the customer bill will be just exchange with the vendor vendor gives his bill to us that is what it is so here the process is same process only sales order step 1 sales order step 2 on the back of it purchase requisition will be created automatically automatically and then third step is po purchase order fourth step, step is invoice vendor invoice vendor invoice invoice finally here customer invoice in in vf0 the only difference here is in material master material master it will be bands bands item category group item category group bands if you change it to bands automatically no more gr or no more goods uh, issue will be there so now let me go and create a sales order let me go go and change it slash and mm02 your material itself i'm using your material itself sir. 3639 ld01 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 ld sales general plan not sales general plan here it is sales organization to bands third party sales bands ban c third party item bans 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 seven now let me create a sales order ba0 sales order or same everything same only see everything same only third party third party payment terms info terms enter the material this is my material a 3639 is permitted no inventory uh, the inventory will not be updated because it is third party quantity one double count this line item continue go to shipping plant enter plant see it purchase requisition is getting created this is a dummy price enter storage location net weight and gross weight seven so now standard order double six seven so double six seven so now pr will be created on on the back of it go to slash it me 21 yen document overview on my purchase requisition go to my purchase requisition this is my purchase requisition 65 this is this is the one 65 adapt 7 7 
Now directly, no more GR. Directly, I'm going to do invoice because it's third party. It's third party. Now go to MIRO. Slash and MI, MIRO. No more goods received or not. This is the one that PO. PO. Hey, it has not come in. PO. This is my PO. Dummy MIR. Let's see. Slash and MI zero. Let's check this. Migo, let's check it. Item OK, post, post. Ah, S4 HANA, in S4 HANA, they have given like, we have to do GR, but then the inventory will never will not be updated here. The inventory will never be updated, but still we have to do GR in S4 HANA. But in ECC, this, this concept is not available. Now, go to slash and MIR, but the inventory will not be updated. Enter. Now it will work. What is it? Enter baseline date. Basic data. 1650. Error is there. Not relevant for track tax. Three nine. Not relevant for tax. One minute. One. Let's check this. Go to fashion. This is F FICU. One seven double one. Let's check this. Let's check this. Stock initial entry. Double A. Display change. Go to display change. Go to control data. Star. Tax category star. Save it. Now go to MIR. MIR. Calculate tax. Baseline date. Baseline date. Seven. Now let's do slash and VM0. Directly VM0. Enter and save. What is it? 